The next person is Alex. Alex, may I ask you to come on stage? I've been listening to your presentation yesterday when you were practicing. I really liked what I saw. I know you're a hands-on person, so I'm very sure that you can talk out of your experience. And I know this will be a very useful presentation. Stage is yours. Ladies and gentlemen, first off, I want to thank the Technical Forum and Access to give me this great opportunity to speak here today. The topic for my presentation is security futures with laser technology. Let me quickly introduce myself. My name is Alexander Aminidis. I'm an application engineer for Access Laser Technology. During my presentation, we will speak about the reason why we choose this topic the design, multiple steps leading to the finished product. We also show you a short video about the processing, and in the end, we have a quick overview about our products. Over the last year, we have many discussions with our customers and with people from the industry. Clearly, we could see that security for coins and metal is very important for today and for the future. As an example for this is the new 5 euro coin with the blue polymer ring in the center. Also, with new security features, we give more competition to electronic cash and paper money. And additionally to all of that, we have more security for our products. With all the technologies, there are some limitations in that spectrum. With laser technology instead, we have new files to find for today and for the future. Of course, it was very important that we create new security features that we cannot implement them only for metals, but also for coins and circulation coins. We need features that are very simple, efficient, with a high durability. Because we don't want to speak only about theoretical possibilities, we created the tools and strike some metals to show you what is possible. For the blanks, we use the brass core with a fine silver coating. The metal has a thickness of 40, of 3 mm and a diameter of 40. Before striking, the blanks are polished and washed. For the tooling, we use the material Böhler K455. The material was already hardened before laser engraving. In the laser engraving, we include all the necessary data, like the rim, the dome, the draft angle, and most part of the design. For the laser engraving, we use the medium distance focal lens. This lens gives us enough details in a bigger working field. For the design, we wanted to include our patented code in code feature. For this, we used the code type Aztec as a base code. Because of this, we link the design to all the geometrics and structures from the Aztec century, like the labyrinth, simple cornered geometrics, the stone steps of an old temple. To spice up the design a little bit, we put everything on the layout on different heights. On the reverse, we included our multiple frostings on the free space. This side is more simple and curved and mostly used for commercials. Now the first security feature is the microtext. We will find the microtext on the stone steps in the design. This microtext has done with an engraving on a small distance focal lens. This lens gives us, realistically speaking, the smallest possible laser beam of only 15 micron. The microtext is also positive, so debris, dirt and dust cannot fill the engraving over time. When we speak about these numbers, please keep in mind that the average size of the human hair is approximately 80 to 100 micron. We achieved a microtext of only 60 micron in height. The next micro feature is the micro symbols. These micro symbols are very simple, more simpler than a text, so we can engrave them even smaller like, like the micro text. These type of micro symbols can be hidden everywhere in the design. The data for the machining has to be very clear and sharp. Because of this, we use the software ArtCam and increase the resolution drastically. The next security feature is the by access patented coding code feature. This coding code feature gives us the possibility to create two different types of codes with two completely separated information. For the bigger code, we use the type of Aztec. 
For the smaller code, instead, we use the DMC data matrix code. Very interesting here is that if the smaller hidden code is missing or in the wrong position, we will not be able to read the bigger code. We can read on the bigger code the information of an internet address. On the smaller hidden code, we have the production date of this metal. You can read the bigger code also with a very modern mobile device. For the hidden code instead, we need a microscope to zoom in. The next security feature is the simple reflection bit. It's basically a very simple geometrical line structure. We see white and black contrast depending on the view angle. We don't see this only on the tool, we see it only also later on the metal. The difference to the simple reflection grid, for example, with rainbow colors, in rainbow colors, the pattern who gives you the effect is in the line. With a simple reflection grid, the line itself is the pattern. On the back side, we invented some different types of frosting, also very light and shiny frosting, which gives us a very optical, interesting optical effect. We can prepare all the different frostings in one program and execute them with the same job. The positioning for the frosting is done with our LASHD Life Adjustment Camera System. For the frosting, we use the high distance focal lens to make a perfect imitation of sandblasting. With our quick hitch function, we can change through all our different lenses without losing the position on the tool. Now I would like to show you a short video about the process. <laughs> Product. This is the obverse side. We see here the all in the presentation shown features. The engraving, the surface structuring, and everything is done with the latest state of the art nanosecond fiber laser on a wavelength of 1064 nanometers. 
we would use instead a picosecond laser due to cold application, cold vaporization of the material, we can engrave even smaller objects and everything up to three times faster. Here we see the backside of the metal, the reverse. We have the multiple frostings in here and the logos of us and our partner for this project, the Staatliche Münzen of Baden-Württemberg in Stuttgart and Karlsruhe. We also have this metal here with us, so if you want to have a look at the futures, you can see it in the break or at the show the next following days. Now I want to give you a quick overview about our products. Here we see the Piranha Micron. We also have this machine here at the show, so you can see the machine in live action. This machine you can equip with a nanosecond laser and soon also with a picosecond laser. The all new Orca Micron, fully built on granite, specialized for the picosecond system. This machine has also a very huge working range. The Pearl Table System, this system is specialized for hallmarking. With an Ultra HD camera system through the galbo head, through the lens field, we can make a very exact positioning. This machine comes also with a wooden ergonomic workplace. <clears throat> the last machine is the Piranha Multi Shift. With two loading towers on the sides, this is an automatic solution, especially in combination with our OPR optical part recognition system. Like I said, if you want to see one of our systems in live action, if you want to have a look at the metal, or want to take one of our new prospects, please visit us here at the well, Money Fair booth C25. Thank you very much. <laughs>